I want to let you in on a little secret. I recently discovered an AI workflow that allows me to build websites twice as fast. And that is the topic of today's video. Hey, my name is Finn. I am a website designer at antler.co and this channel is all about teaching you web design through real life projects. And right now what I want to teach you is how to design websites twice as fast. 90% of web designers aren't even using this process. So I'll be taking you step by step. And at the end of the video, I'm going to share a few resources that you can use to get started with this today. Before I reveal the AI workflow, I want to show you the one thing slowing down your web design process. Let's take a look at a very standard web design process. We have one week for strategy, content planning and sitemap, one to two weeks, one week of wireframing, and then design is about three weeks. But in the real world, this entire process can be ruined because of one thing, content. What I found is that clients are often very confused and disorganized about their website content. They often don't have any content ready, or when they do have content, it looks a bit like this. What the fuck is this piece of shit? This meant I was spending weeks with my clients trying to help them write their website copy, or I was designing websites without any content. And this would lead to lots of design revisions because as it turns out, it's really hard to design a website if you don't know what's going on the page. If you're a web designer, this is probably sounding all very familiar. Content is the slowest and most painful part of the design process. But what if there was a way to make it a hundred times faster and a lot easier? In fact, there is, and using the AI process I'm gonna show you in this video, you can get your content, sitemap, and wireframes all done in about an hour. That's a very bold claim, but I'm gonna show you exactly how it works very, very soon. Before I do that, one more note to make. After working with plenty of freelance clients, I realized something really important. Clients were really bad at writing their content on a blank page. But one thing I noticed is that once I had the wireframes finished, the client was really, really quick at updating the content that I had written for them. It's much easier to take something that already exists and modify it rather than building it from scratch. And this is the secret to why the process I'm about to show you works so well. But I know you're still wondering, how do we go from nothing to wireframes in one hour? Well, that's what we're moving on to right now. By the way, if you're enjoying the video, please hit a like, it really, really helps me out. And consider subscribing because I've got way more videos like this one on the way. All right, now it's time to look at this AI process I've been telling you about. The process starts with a 30 minute strategy call with your client. And this entire meeting is transcribed by an AI note taker. This transcription is turned into a project brief using AI. And that project brief is fed into our AI site builder, which will actually generate the content and wireframes for us. Let's take a look at how I actually did this on a real life client project. I met with a client for our strategy call. This is a 30 minute call where I asked them a bunch of questions about their business, their goals, what content they need, what pages they need. Now I used to write this down and I would go between listening and writing. I would forget things. It was a real nightmare. But now we have Otter AI, which is an AI tool that transcribes the entire meeting for you that allows you to focus on asking the right questions, digging deeper into the questions instead of trying to type and write down. It's a lot easier. To make sure we get the right information from the client, I have a list of pre-prepared questions that I always ask the client. I've made a list of all these questions for you. So you can just go to the first link in the description and you can get those questions that I ask. Once the meeting finishes, you should have an entire transcription of everything that was said in that meeting. And keep that transcription safe because it's very important for the next part of the process. Our next step is to take that transcription into ChatGPT because what we want to do is turn that you know transcript into a concise website project brief that will outline what the client's goals are their content strategy i have a prompt for this so again first link in the description will have all these prompts that you need now that brief i actually save that as a pdf to go over with the client to ensure we're aligned the next prompt is actually taking that brief and condensing it down even further into a prompt for reloom and this smaller prompt has to be under 3,000 characters is what we're gonna feed into Reloom to create our website. We're gonna make sure that this prompt is extra descriptive about the pages that we need on the site and about what content will be on those pages and also about 
know, the client's industry. Again, I've made that prompt for you already, so you don't have to worry about that. Link in the description. Now, this is the part where all the magic happens. Reloom is currently the most powerful AI site builder on the web. Simply create a new project in Reloom, then take your site prompt from ChatGPT and add it into Reloom's site prompt and click generate. Reloom will literally build you a sitemap and organize all of your content into sections, but it doesn't stop there. You can click up here on wireframes and Reloom will wireframe your whole website. And the content inside these wireframes is AI generated based on the client's industry and the content strategy from the prompt. And there you have it, a fully wireframed website. In the course of one hour, you've gone from knowing practically nothing about the client's business all the way to fully fledged wireframes in about an hour. That is huge because I used to spend weeks on this entire process. The reason I'm making this video is because I know it's gonna help all of you so much in speeding up your design process. But don't click away just yet because there are a couple more things you need to know about this process. First of all, the client will definitely want to update this content. And that's great because like I said before, it's much easier for the client to update content on a web page that already exists than start from a blank page. You can invite them to your reading workspace where they can leave comments and help you organize the content or add content that is missing. The other point is about the wireframes. These are only version one of wireframes. You might wanna change some of these things around, which in Reloom is super easy. All you do is click on the section and you can choose from literally hundreds of layouts and wireframes. So based on the client's feedback or your personal taste, you can finish up wireframing the website here in Reloom. Now there's one really important thing to end on here is that this process saves you a lot of time, right? So what can you do with all the spare time you have now? There's a couple of options for you. The first one is you can start taking on more client projects. So if you wanna make more money, you can actually just start getting more projects and handling them. But personally, that's not the approach that I take. What I do is I reinvest that saved time back into the project. You see, what I care about is working with less clients and really investing and delivering as much value as possible. So all this time that I saved from the content, I reinvest into the visual design stage. And this means we end up with a much more quality design and the client was happy because things were done efficiently and I'm happy because I can focus on what I care about, which is the visual design. A lot of people think that designers are just pushing generate and building entire websites. And at least for me, that's not the case yet. Actually, the way AI helps designers is by removing that really annoying content process and letting you focus more of your energy on the actual design and creative part of the project. So there you have it, that is my process and I hope you find it really, really useful. Remember I left everything in the description here so you can actually get these prompts and the right questions for the strategy meeting in the link below. But all this actually doesn't matter if you're not getting any clients. So I made this video about how to use LinkedIn as a designer so you can start getting clients. Thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you in the next one.